Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil. In the previous episode, I got to tell you more about what was coming up after this Let's Play is finished. Um, we, video-wise, we destroyed Plant 42 and we met up with Wesker, who left us the note here uh, that he left some bullets in that room, and then we, you know, stored them, did whatnot. Um. So yeah, um, in this episode we will be, I believe, fighting Yon again, because he is to the left, down this hallway. I hope I'm prepared. And yeah, we got hunters again, because we're out of the garden. So, that's fun. That's fun. Shooting hunters in the face. Now then, with this key that Wesker gave us in the previous episode, uh, you can get into the room with the red jewel. However, since I came here first, I was way too lazy to go all the way to the other side of the mansion, and therefore I don't end up getting the red jewel. And the red jewel is how you get the cold python. So, yeah, I don't end up getting the cold python, but just to let you know, that's where that is. Now then, we have uh, him again, and yeah, this should be interesting. I believe I just killed him with the bazooka in Jill's Chris doesn't have that, so let's see how many shots we can get in here. Alright, come on, you stupid snake. Quit biting my leg. What are you trying to do? That was way too close. Um, I need to go heal, but uh, a hole open in the fire. So that's how he got in. I had never read that before. There's apparently a hole in the fireplace, just like there was a hole in the attic. I did not read that before, and now he's turned into some, to some type of purple goo. And then when we come back in, it will have disappeared. Where it went, no one knows, but. Maybe Wesker came in and cleaned it up. I mean, who knows? I mean, in the end, no matter what, really, uh, Wesker was gonna blow this place up. So, it's not like any evidence would be found. I don't know, maybe Rebecca has an OCD. She just keeps going around, Oh, this has to be clean. That's why all the corpses are disappearing. Perhaps Barry had the same one. So Rebecca and Barry have an OCD for cleaning things, and uh, that's where all the corpses are going. Otherwise, the whole place would be just littered with corpses. Alright, and I'm back at fine. Now, do I have any green herbs that I can bring with me? Yes, I do. Should probably store those just in case. Um, we got another green herb there. First aid, crank. That's all we should need. I'm feeling lucky. Okay, I'm, um, Okay, I say I'm feeling lucky and then I can't get through the door. That's wonderful. Alright, so now we need to go jump in a hole. This time, however, we don't have, like, Rebecca or anything to come in and say, Oh, by the way, uh, here, use this rope. Nope. Chris, he's gonna just jump on down. It's Cause he's Chris Redfield. He can jump from, you know. Hello, ya hunter. I did not remember I hadn't killed you. I don't even know why I came over this way, but I did. And I wasted a whole bunch of shells in the process of coming over there. However, I'm not in danger, which I thought I would be. But he's Chris, so he can take more damage. Come on back in here. No need for the lighter of lighter anymore. We have the second floor map. And we got the shotgun shells for the candles downstairs. So, lighter of lighter has gone away again. Hello, red door. Open up for me, please. Ah, crap. Yeah, it crashed on me again. Stupid door. Alright, Chris, go jump in a hole. 
No offense, but I want you to die. Falls down hole, breaks his legs. Just like Shadowgate, eh? Should push some zombies down holes then. Break their legs. They wouldn't be able to do much but crawl around. And now we get another ladder to descend. Will you just Yes, of course. It's not like I'm going to climb up out of the hole. I don't have a rope. Alright, now we get to run around in the hall. Uh, hello, zombie. Don't hurt me. Blow your head off. Alright, he's dead. And there should be some shot. Oh, really? There's a zombie there. I did not know. I was just after the shotgun shells, really. Hmm. I'm at caution already. That's not good. Uh, hey, I got some shells. Some shells. Okay. English strikes back. Mwahaha. <laughs> Anywho. Now we gotta go through this door. Now, if you're going through advanced mode, I'm pretty sure this place is full of hunters instead of zombies. Which is kinda hard. And, uh, there's zombies in here, if you couldn't tell from the chewing of flesh. And I'm just gonna leave them to what they're doing. You unlocked it. Okay, then go through the door. What was the point of even having it locked? There's no other way to get into this room, if I remember right. Yeah, there is absolutely no other way to get into this room. Unless Chris can get the passcode, and I'm just not knowing how he does. Oh, come on. He was dead. That was not cool. Wow, stupid zombie. Uh, looks like... I thought I saw something sparkle on the counter here. Water is not supplied. Is it, ah, there it is. Gas cooking stove. No. Sparkle. Okay. Small key. I can't think of any other places we could use that, actually. So, skip it. Unless I can find something else. And, uh... Here we got another zombie, if I remember right, from Jill's scenario. Just a zombie, not a hunter. However, it might be like slightly faster or stronger, I don't remember. Either way, I'm about to blow it to smithereens. Come here, I wanna blow your head off. Blowing zombie heads off. Chris Redfield. And he's dead. Alright, um, let's think here going upstairs or I could just take the elevator like I'm supposed to hmm let's take the stairs then cause we want to be complicated no I'm actually gonna go unlock a door that's why I'm going upstairs so this should lead to the hallway with the first zombie of the game Actually, I am, uh, well, never mind. I was about to say I'm low on health, so I should probably go to the safe room, but then I used the herb, so. Yeah. Okay, never mind. Yeah, so just ignore that. I, I was being stupid. Talking out of my head. Uh. Let's just go through this whore. What? Door. My English. Just. Yeah, those are very similar things, you know. Ah. Uh, it would be, it would have at least been better if I said hole, but you know, I'm stupid. Why? <laughs> okay, let's just take the elevator then. You can tell that I am tired.
because it's too early in the morning to be let's playing. Actually, you know, it's only, you know, 10. I don't know why I'm... Well, no, it's not 10. What the heck? I read the time wrong. That is, uh... Let's see, that's 8.30. You know, very similar to 10. I'm not... Oh, whoops. I was reading, uh... My timer for my... Yeah. Okay. It's been 10 minutes into the episode. It's not 10 o'clock. I was about to say, is it 10.30 and increasing at a very fast pace? Ooh, headshot. I'm just like, well, uh, 10's going by pretty fast. I mean, 10.50 already. I think it's been like a minute. If hours passed on by minutes, like minutes, um, well, I think we'd all be dead. Here in a couple days, anyway. Or I'm very terrible at math, so don't make a comment about my crappy math skills. Um, yeah, let's continue. Oh, we got a green herb. Very good. We got another one also. Find that there. Use that. Grab the other green herb. And now we can go grab that battery that we can use to, you know, get into the Arclay Mountain Lab. Down into the lab. What? No, not into the Arclay Mountain Lab. Uh, the caverns. What the hell am I talking out of my head, guys? Too early. It's too early. 8.30. It's too early. Don't wake up in the morning at 8.30. Of let's play. <laughs> we'll make you mad after this, I think. Mm, battery, yes. Mm, shells, of course. There should be another. S yep, there's some more shells. Yeah. Okay. Okay, what's in here? I'm thinking this is the library place, isn't it? Yes, yes it is. Now we might actually be able to read that report that, you know, I didn't get to see because, or you guys didn't get to see because in Jill's scenario, this whole place messed up. Yeah, see, it's sitting there on the pedestal. And is he, yes he is. Anyway, this is a scrapbook report. It is about some woman getting mutilated, mutilated. Um, in the Arclay Mountains, people being found dead, and then, in the end, there's a news report saying, Hey, if you're a feisty one, go check this out, eh? And it's just like, really? The news, even? No wonder Raccoon City gets blown up. It's just like, wow, really? Spoiler alert. Oh, too bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, a clip. Wonderful. That's all we really need in here. I mean, you can look out the window for the airport. Or airport. Helicopter landing place thingy. Right. Heliport. And, uh, yeah. We can go ahead and look in here. This should be the Mo Disc. Ooh, that's the modisk. I I actually planned this out perfectly. Um, my inventory is full, isn't it? Uh, I can use the green herb to just make sure that my inventory is perfectly fine. See, I can use the green herb. See, and now I'm at fine. Green fine, not yellow fine. So, my inventory is perfectly fine along with my health. Plan that out perfectly, mind you. That was planned out. <clears throat> right, anyway, just gonna go ahead and push this to the side and 
sorry. Um, well, my dad actually just asked me to go get donuts. So, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and grab this, uh, Mo disc here, and, uh, apparently I'm gonna go get donuts. So, uh, I will see you all next time in, uh, Let's Play Resident Evil. Hooray for Mo discs! Alright, uh, see you all next time. Uh, goodbye.